Cut. Hi everyone, I'm Amina and welcome back explorers to my vlog. Also, if you happen to be new here or are a repeat visitor, be welcome. Be sure to also look at the description below for all credits given and also any links that I might be hiding down there. <sighs> so, with all that said, good morning everyone. Now, for my last vlog, I switched over from talking about animes to the cartoons that I actually grew up with. And, um, I centered mainly on the cartoon Jim and the Holograms, and also the reason I watched it, because I thought it was a superhero cartoon, Secret Disguises, uh, Action Adventure, that kind of stuff. Oh, entry. <laughs> However, I didn't get what the intrigue actually was. I just knew that people were trying to kill each other. But why? Anyway, I also talked about the fact that the gem and the holograms was actually created to sell dolls. The same dolls that were made by Hasbro. <laughs> and, um, yeah. Hasbro made Jim and the Holograms for those dolls, and those dolls were specifically just music based. It was all music. Uh, and Jim was either a huge rock star or uh, a record company mogul? Well, owner of a record company. So, why is this important? Well, even though Hasbro had that out before Mattel even got in the bandwagon, Mattel had Barbie. And she was everything. She was the teacher, she was the doctor, she was the astronaut. Um, and uh, Mattel didn't like that Hasbro had a doll doing something that Barbie hadn't yet. So, yeah, there was a little bit of, um, uh, toy wars in the aisles. So, one side had Barbie, one side had Gem and Holograms. I don't know how it all went down, but it would be nice to actually be able to get a hold of one of the Gem dolls along with the Barbie, just to say that I did have them, <laughs> or do have them, but that doesn't matter right now. Now, Gem and Holograms was made in order to sell dolls, and also music was a bonus. So, there was a cassette that was sold with each doll, and each cassette contained a music track by Jim and the Holograms, or the rival band, the Misfits. And in the third season, I believe, there was music by a group called the Stingers. I have to revisit the cartoon that I can find in its entirety on Tubi TV. Now, 
Gemini yeah, holograms also spawn a comic book and a live action movie. However, a lot of the old time fans of the original cartoon concept were none too happy with the live action movie. So, places you can currently find Jim and the Holograms content are on Tubi TV, YouTube, and until April 15th, Netflix. So, if you haven't seen it yet, go ahead and see it. However, there is a reason people aren't happy with the movie. I will definitely sit down and watch it to come to my own conclusions. But I've seen a little bit from both the animations and other stuff to know that it's not the same as the cartoon. Not even by the slightest. There are references, but that's it. Just references. Not actual stuff. So, as one group said, the movie is Jim and the Holograms in name only, not by content. Well, I'll have to see it for myself to make my own uh, judgment. <laughs> but I need to talk about the movies that were actually made. The original, totally outrageous movie for Jim and the Holograms, totally outrageous animated movie is quite literally the pilot to the full-length cartoon, which is a total of three seasons. It does have an end, but not quite the end people wanted because it got canceled due to Mattel <laughs> and other things. The sales for the dolls went drastically downhill at that point. So that's not fun. Of course, there was a live action movie, which is currently on Netflix until April 15th of 2023. Oh, be sure to check to be TV occasionally because I did see it pop up there once in a while, but it didn't stay very long. So, be quick about it. And, of course, the people on YouTube made a... people on uh, YouTube specifically a channel called Chickbait were really upset by the trailer and movie. So they made their own fan movie, which I will, well, as I said before, I will leave links to all the gem content that I can uh, get to you. And um, aside from the animated movie, which I'm currently going to be watching. I'll also watch the live action and the fan made movie and review all three of them for my next vlog. So until then, I'm going to leave you all with us. If you have been enjoying my content, Please feel free to leave a like and or subscribe. You can also 
leave a comment down below in the comment section. Please do. Be sure to hit that notification bell because YouTube doesn't always like to share. Be safe, be healthy, and as always, be true to you. Amina, signing out.